preview tarot. <laughs> Mga kasangga, ang ating Queen Bea Alonzo ay maririnig na ang special message ng universe sa kanya ngayong 2024. Guest kasi siya ng preview tarot. Let's watch this, guys. So, Bea, tell us, nagpataro ka na ba before? Yes, I actually did one <laughs> sa vlog ko. So, mm. shout out kay Nikki Vizcara. <laughs> Nagpa-read ulit ako. And actually, mm. I was so amazed. Kasi, to be honest, nakaka-good vibes yeah. din. Kasi, she said a lot of like wonderful things, positive things. And mm -hmm. I think, dahil na-manifest niya, in a way, because he put it out there for yeah. the universe to hear, mm -hmm. somehow, parang maraming nagkatotoo dun sa sinabi mm -hmm. niya. To be honest, I was a bit apprehensive. Kasi, di ba yeah. marami nagsasabi if you're spiritual or if you're religious, you shouldn't be doing this. Yeah. But I think pwede ka namang hindi maniwala or mm -hmm. it's really up to you. And as for me, I still believe in God and I know that He is in control of my life. He is the one driving my life and my destiny. But, you know, parang minsan fun din to do this. Great, so first, we'll be sharing with you the message from the universe. So, it, yung difference kasi nito, it will mm -hmm. be a joint reading. Okay, so ganito okay. gagawin. We're gonna let you pick a deck. So, may, ito yung deck ko, lahat yan. Okay. Tapos, ito yung kay Reg. Okay. Yes. So we'll let you pick. Ito yung nag-jump kanina. So your message of the universe is Wheel of Fortune. So it's Wheel of Fortune kasi it's a major arcana. It's all about destiny, karma, basically yung flow of life. Sometimes you're down and it's all part of life. Kasi one of the things that they want to remind you is just flow with it kasi meron kang pupuntahan ng maganda. And always to speak up and use your voice to express yourself. Kasi even if we're going along the path of life, you still have a say on where you want to direct it. Basically, yung mga decisions natin before, nakikita na natin yung manifestation, yung results niya, yung mga outcome niya. Kasi one choice, even if super basic choice lang niya, it can set the ball in motion. Na parang hindi natin alam na one small decision, it can lead to a totally different path. So, it's just reminding you to always speak up. Kasi nandun din sa'yo yung control on where you want to go. Even if life takes us up and down. Minsan kasi akala natin pag down, yun na yun. Pero hindi natin nakikita. Yung down na yun, it's just like yung mga mountain range lang siya. Na it doesn't mean bottom. It just means that you're moving and you're moving. Nice. And yeah. just speak up. Okay, that's nice. That's nice. Thank you. I so your first card, ito dun sa Ten of Cups. I feel like you're in a place na you're satisfied. You're basically content. You feel yeah, fulfilled. Yes. Yeah. With your life, like what's going on. So, parang go into that kind of mindset moving forward. Like, in a wheel of fortune. Because things are, will be changing. But as long as you have that feeling of fulfillment within, you can overcome anything. Yeah. Ganon. Other message is confidence. Ayan para ako, oh my gosh, yun talaga. So, yung confidence naman. So, basically, ayun nga, even with the ups and downs, you just have to be confident. As in, yung tipong, alam mo, kahit may mga hardships, kaya kaya to. And may prayer kasi siya. It's like, it's oh, so cute. Okay. There's like a prayer here. It says like, divine confidence is completely different from the bravado of the ego. You make space for something larger to take hold. Please fill me with your confidence, O oh love. Grant me courage I never knew I had. So, it's like oh. a mantra na you can like, you know, yeah. you can repeat to yourself. Goodbye. Yeah. You just have to be confident. As in, go take on. Take control oh, with your life. Oh, yeah, take the hold of your Speak reins. up, be exactly. confident, and be on, in control of your life. Exactly. Like good okay. things are happening. Yes, like, it it's is. all set in motion na talaga. So, parang, anin mo yung momentum na yun. Yeah. Move forward with it. Okay. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is very timely, to be honest. Oh. Yeah. Oo nga. Di ba wala namang coincidence, I believe? Oo, no, so, I agree. So maybe agree. you're sending a message to me today. Yes. So thank you. <laughs> thank you, universe. Ayun. No, thank you, universe. <laughs> Top of mind lang, will I be proud of myself and my choices in the next five years? Ooh. Or in five years, will I be proud of myself? Ace of Wands. Ako, Ace of Swords. Okay, last. Oh my gosh! The star. Oh, oh my. Okay. Okay. Ano ba yun? may death. Hindi, huwag kang mag-alala. Oh, oh, oh. we, we're gonna explain. Yeah. Sige, next naman. Challenge. Ay! Ay! Oh. Happy endings! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Happy endings, though! <laughs> Guys, I 
my cat. Sorry. Bago <laughs> talaga magka-happy ending. Kailangan may challenges talaga. mo muna talaga. Kasi hindi mo talaga ma-appreciate yung happiness if there is so, no sadness. So, sa akin naman, feeling ko kasi siya yung mas maganda, like yung outcome nito. So, right now kasi you feel a little bit doubtful. Will I be proud of myself, di ba, in the next five years? So, lumabas yung the moon part. I mean, the moon. Mm -hmm. The moon kasi ito, it represents yung illusions natin, delusions, like yung subconscious. Ito yung fear mo. Like, mm. trend reflect. So, you feel afraid na you're not doing the best that you can right now. Pero the thing is, you have the Ace of Wands. And yung Ace of Wands kasi, the Ace is like opportunity and Wands is like action. So, parang nire-remind na do what you do best in your life right now. Kasi, once you do the star, the star, ito alam mo naman like, Ano, wish upon a star, tapos yung mga dreams mo, they'll come true. So, kaya lumabas yung challenges. Parang, it's not saying na, mag, al alam mo yun, like, every day may challenge. I mean, of course, pero you'll get through it. Kasi yung message dito is like, unbearable situations throw you directly into God's arms if you are open. Please take over divine and guide the right actions. Please take this burden and show me your will. So, remember your North Star, and then you'll get through your life. Yeah. That's nice. Thank you. Similar to what you yeah, got, I feel like, in the recent past, everything looked okay on paper. There was something that was brewing at the back of your mind. No. Outside of your control. Like, there was something that was bothering you pa rin. But the thing is, never mo siyang in-acknowledge. Kasi you feel like, hey, I should be content. Bakit ba ako napabother dito? But in reality, the more na tinatry mo siyang i-push under the rock, the more kanyang napabother pa rin. With that lingering thought na parang, Uy, andito pa rin ako. I mean, andito pa rin yung thought na yun. Na parang, pansinin mo naman. So, in the past, you had to rely on yourself and focus on the good. Hindi mo talaga muna in-acknowledge yung part na yun because you feel na it would make you seem ungrateful or if acknowledging that would invalidate all the blessings that's happening in your life. So right now, there's something that's giving you anxiety, I guess, what the next five years will hold. Given what is happening now, ano pa yung next step? So ano yung what's ahead? Will it surpass kung ano man yung mga achievements or yung mga good things na nangyayari sa'yo right now? The more na iniisip mo siya na paano mo siya tatahakin, hindi mo na-enjoy yung journey towards it. So I think you're being invited to Surrender. Just to be clear, yung death card kasi, it's not scary kasi usually naman yung death card, it's like transformation, it's like yung mga... Death of the old you. Yes, yes. exactly. Yes. Rebirth, gano'n. Uh, death rebirth. rebirth cycle. Yes. So it's not scary. Yeah. yeah. It's actually very inviting na parang, what's one thing that's been holding you back here na pwede mo nang let go to bring you to a brighter, happy ending? Love it! Yeah. <laughs> Kinabahan ako dyan. Char. Thank you so much. Parang ang positive lahat. But I'm just really curious because most of the time, ang nagbibigay naman sa atin ng anxiety is the future. True. The unknown. Not knowing what the future holds. True. And and most of the time, that's what I question. Eh. Whenever I'd have to make a very difficult decision, yung life-changing decision, that's what I would always think about. Parang, ha, will I be proud of myself in five years or in ten years? How will this change my life or the way I am, the way I see the world, the way I treat people? Na parang you feel mo a bit more hopeful na talaga moving yeah. forward. Well, know? yeah. I'm always man hopeful because yes. you, I have God with yes. me all the time, helping me with my decisions all the time. Now it's your turn. Oh my gosh, I've never done this before, okay. but I'll try, you guys. Okay. Para for fun lang naman. It doesn't mean na lahat ng sasabihin ko totoo or siguro lahat ng napapasok sa utak ko, 'di ba? Okay. I will so, be the instrument. So, now time for you guys to pick one. So, if you have chosen the first one, so this is one, this is two, this is three. Your reading for today is. Oh my God! Look, Mama, we show now. It's a morning show. It's a reading segment. Aquarius. Blah 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 blah. If you have chosen the first one, this is the reading. Warrior woman. Have you answered your deepest calling? It means I think you have to look into yourself today. 
ano ba talaga yung purpose mo in this world? And are you somehow picking the right choices towards that direction wherein you can perform your mission on this earth? And are you fighting for that? Kasi sometimes we settle for jobs that are available na hindi na natin pinaglalaban what we really want in life, what we want to do in life. And I think it's about time for you to think about that again. Pause and then re-evaluate your life. Are you happy? Will this make you happy in 10 years? And kung hindi, maybe it's about time for you to do something about it. Find a way to get back on track when it comes to reaching for your dreams again. We have chosen card number two. The reading for you is... Starseed. What lights you up? It means that you have to bring out the child in you again. What makes you light up? Ano ba? Masyado ka na bang drowned sa trabaho? I think it's about time for you to have some fun, meet up with your friends, smell the roses, and just let your hair down. Sometimes kasi when we get too focused on work, we forget to have fun. Diba? Parang we forget to just be kids again. Be innocent and see the world from a different perspective. I think it's about time for you guys to do that. If you have chosen number two. That's my reading for you. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. If you have chosen card number three, the reading for you is... Oh my gosh, this is birthing a new age, birthing new creations, dreaming a new world into being. I think it's about time for you to embrace the creator in you. That's what I think. <laughs> you have to embrace the creator in you. Do not be afraid to share with the world what you think. And sabi nga ni ano, di ba? Walt Disney, if you can imagine it, it is achievable. Well, hindi yun yung tama sinabi niya. But yeah, I think that's my dick. I don't know kung yun verbatim. But if you can imagine it, it's possible. You have to embrace your creativity and share it with the world. Because if you have it, why why will you keep it to yourself? Ang sayang kasi it's a gift from God. And you have to share it with the world and who knows maybe in the future you can touch somebody else's life like for example if you want to become an actor just do it and then eventually you can touch other people's lives maybe you can you know inspire other people to do the same as well of course if you're feeling depressed or I know you have to seek help yes or, of course Sempre better kung professional help, but you can also seek help from your friends, yes. talk to somebody, your family. It would always help. Kailan mo naman mga professional oh, oh, guys? I have to reiterate, I am not a professional. I'm just trying to have fun over here. <laughs> well, that's it. That was fun. Thank you guys. Yes. Sobra ano, you made my day. That was really fun. I hope you guys also enjoyed as much as we did. Don't forget to subscribe to Previews YouTube channel to see more of this and uh, more exciting episodes. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye!